Hey guys, Wallen Customs here, and today is another unboxing video. So we'll take a look at that. And also, I bought a couple of things on the side over the weekend. So we'll take a look at that really quickly. So for one thing, we have the Transformers Robots in Disguise, and this is Strong Arm right here. The new cartoon. Uh, not bad. Hopefully the autofocus is working. As you see right there. Um, add it to my collection. Why not? I also got this little guy as well. Which is pretty cool. I actually wanted the head and the little accessory right here. So let's see how that works out. Not bad at all. Put to the side. Over the weekend, I actually saw... If you guys follow me on Instagram, you might have seen that I found the Voltron. You know, the, the new Voltron from Netflix. You... You know, I found the Black Lion one. Man, I have to say, it's huge. I didn't realize how big they were. They were so big. So it kind of made me think about it. Man, I get this one, I have to get the other ones. And this is going to be a really big figure to have. So I decided not to get it anymore. It's too big. Way too big. I don't know where I'm going to put it. So I actually hit it. I put it behind diapers. And I put it on Instagram and also on a couple other Facebook groups. So if anyone wanted it and that was in the area, I let them have it. Hopefully someone got it. But all right. Here is the first unboxing. Now, like I said, this is a very heavy Transformers unboxing, so if you're not into that, sorry. But there is something pretty cool in here that you might like, even even though if you're not into Transformers. We'll get to that. Oh, but this one right here. These are from TF Source. She's used because either it's really hard to find now mints or very expensive so we're not about that. So we got Wheeljack right here complete pretty cool this is from the Transformers Prime series I like this I love Transformers Prime like I said, like I said you know, if you guys don't remember me saying that Transformers Prime is probably easily my favorite Transformers cartoon in a long time, aside from Beast Wars, of course, but uh, this is pretty cool. It's not bad. It's not bad buying stuff used, guys, you know. Don't, no need to spend all the money. And this one is actually Bumblebee from an older generation's line, but this is pretty cool. Bumblebee one, a little trailer in the back that's a uh, speedboat. Not a speedboat, what is this thing? Whatever it's called. Alright, now for the fun stuff. Fun stuff. The big stuff. Oh, I was able to watch Doctor Strange. Not bad of a movie. Pretty good. I have to admit. It's a really fun movie. I'm in the middle of watching Moana, the new Disney cartoon. Uh, that's not that bad either. I saw Resident Evil, also, the latest one, to finally end the chapter. That movie's horrible. Oh my god. Alright, here we go. Ah, oh, this guy looks awesome. Alright, so first off, right here, we have... This is from Make Toys. This is Ryder Des... Despatron. Ryder Despatron. This is basically Megatron. It looks pretty nice. I like this one right here. Looks pretty cool. Next up, we have here. Nice packaging, by the way, by TF Source. So, this one is by Mastermind Creations. This is a third party brand right here. And it's Titanic Titanica. Now, this is a really big transformer. She's huge. The funny part is, when I first bought this, I didn't know it was a girl. Not, not, not like it makes a difference, but um, she's purple. I mean, she's called Titanica. I guess she's a girl, but she doesn't look like one. But this is pretty cool as well. Let's see if that auto focuses. Don't know if it is, but there you go. Looks pretty interesting. Alright, so next up we have this guy, which I was really interested in just by looking at it. I don't even know who he is, or even, even if he's a real character, but. It looks really cool, so 
Gotham. And I have some plans for him. So this guy is made from T uh, Toy World Japan, and he's actually just a plain old SUV Transformer Blue, and that's pretty much what he is. What is his name? T W T O Four Highway. I'm not even sure that's his real name, but um, pretty cool. What I plan to do with this one is to paint his exterior of the car white, kind of match my actual car in real life. So. This is just a little experiment I'm going to do with this one. But, the cool thing, now I know, some people will like, is this guy. Or this thing. thing. It's not even a transformer. This is a throne. This is Grimlock's throne. This is a box, right here. This is actually by Hasbro, it looks like, which is pretty interesting. It's so light, it's the funny part. It's pretty much just probably hollow plastic. I'm going to open it right now, actually. Let me take a look at it. It says Hasbro on the back. I didn't, actually, I didn't even know that was actually Hasbro. Let's take a look at it. And it's literally just like plastic. Foam plastic. Not even, not foam plastic, but it's hollow plastic, as you can see. Kind of cheap, but it's a nice big giant chair. A throne. So if you have a big transformer, it's supposed to be able to fit like masterpiece sizes. So if you have like a masterpiece Grimlock or something like that, it'll fit on this. And there's two pieces right here. And there's little slits where you can slide it together, but I'll do that later. Uh, but essentially, it'll look like this. And there you go, you have a nice throne. You can put Megatron on that. Take the throne out of the Autobots. Uh, you have Optimus. If you have a, obviously if you have Grimlock, then there you go. So this is pretty cool. You know, it's not the craziest looking, best construction, but at least you have a big giant throne. And if you know, you can't really get rid of that Autobot symbol. I mean, you can cover it. Um, you could probably use this for your six-inch figures, maybe even seven-inch figures. So that'd be pretty cool. All right, guys. So that's about it. It's a nice unboxing I had. Got a, nice, a lot of nice Transformers. Like I said before, I am heavily getting into Transformers again. I do not know why. It's just happening. Uh, so that's about it, guys. I will have more reviews coming up. I have some more action figures coming up as well. So don't worry about that, guys. I know some, not all of you are Transformers fans. Um, but don't worry. I still have a lot of action figures to go. So. Alright, that's about it guys. Thanks for watching. Like always, comment, criticize, subscribe, do whatever you want to pay attention. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. You can go to wildcustoms.com. Like the video. Thumbs up. Peace.